and welcome back to my channel. My name is Cindy and you're watching Little Star Plants. If you're new here, welcome to the family. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more planner related videos. In this video, I'll be showing you how I set up my week of 39 in Hobonichi Cousin using these printed photos. You can also do the same with printed photos on a piece of paper and then cut them by hand. A week ago, I asked my Instagram family to pick up which style I should set up for this week's spread. The option was fall colors or white slash gray theme. And 60% voted for fall theme and the rest voted on white and gray. So here are the photos I have already pre-cut and placed them around the spread. Move the photos around until you are happy the way it looks in your spread. By doing this, this allows you to visualize how the spread possibly look like before gluing them down in your spread. I am also trying a new style for this week's spread. I am adding some inspiration quotes for each day near the bottom of the page. You'll see later on how I divide the page by drawing a line across the page. You also see that I only have four images for this week's spreads. The main reason for this is that I wanted to keep this spread as minimalistic as possible without cluttering too many pictures and colors. I will also be adding character stickers as well. If you're ever interested in my character sticker, feel free to check out my website listed in the description below. You will also see I reference back and forth to my previous week's sidebar frequently. That's because I wanted to make sure that my spread bar is consistent with this week's spread. I also made a video on how I decorate different trackers on my sidebar. Feel free to watch that and I'll link it to this video's card. Here is the close-up setup for the week of 39. Let's come back shortly at the end of the week to recap on how we did for this week. Hi everyone, this is end of the week recap on my spread of week 39. I'm trying a different format video. Hopefully you guys kind of enjoy seeing before and after how the spread looks like. Um, oftentimes when I plan out for the week, I do it the day off. Oftentimes I don't make a video plan with me in Hobonichi and that's the reason why. Hopefully this video might be much more beneficial to show you guys what was it before and after. Here is the week of 39 and I think this week spread looked very nice. It's actually something I did not expect expected. There's lots of orange and lots of red in this spread and very but let's just talk about the spread what I have done differently for this week compared to previous week. First off would be photos. So the photos here I have added four photos. I think it really stand out on my spread and I really like that. For the sidebar it still remains the same as compared to my previous weeks. Far so nothing much has changed except I added Mimi and her friends sticker, washi on the side, kind of filled the blank spaces. Other things I have tried out is adding washi tape. So I did add washi tape here from Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, kind of fill out some of the blank spaces. On the right on the side here on Sunday, I did something different. This is actually Muji's um, third tape. I just want to add it there, kind of give a nice touch to that side there. Another thing I did mention that I wanted to add some inspiration quotes at the bottom. In the end, I wrote some things that are some quotes in there. I also added some stickers related to self-care. So I think that's, I think adding a pictures do add a lot of nice touch to the week. I did add some foil stickers. So you can see like there are some foil stickers on some of the days, especially this one maybe with the haircut and the bow sticker and the weekend sticker. And if this is a video format that you like to see more of before and after, please let me know in the comments below and I'll try my best to try more of this type of video format. It'll be kind of fun to see before and after my spreads. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more planning related videos. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys!